All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to finish off the last of this uh, case here. The first three, we got 20 Mythics. Uh, yeah, 20 Mythics. I don't know if that's a good thing, bad thing, but again, we're going to spend about $3,000. We're going to run through these like it's nothing. We want to... Well, I'm just basically trying to get my spend up with Magic the Gathering. I do want the one ring. Again, this is going to be one of those things where it's a trial and error. If I lose $900, lose $1,000, uh, I'll be okay. That's fine. Uh, if I lose over $2,000, that, that's, a, that's a different story. I'll be sad. I'll be very, very sad. That's a, I'll be very sad if we lose that kind of money. It's, that's, that, that, that type of money you can't really come back from. So we will start cracking these open here. Um, it's going to be the last three from the case. Uh, nothing too crazy, so I'm hoping that this is going to be a little bit better. Last one, we got 20 mythic, so we want to beat the mythic count. All right, we got the uncommon, we got the regular lands, we got the rares. All right, we got the rares right there. We got the uncommon, uncommon. You know, this is going to be very difficult to sort. I'm just looking at it now. Token. Oh, right on the side, because with all of this and all of these things, it's like golly, that's going to be rough. Mm-hmm. Rare, rare, rare. I wonder oh, I think you know what I'm gonna I think when I'm listing these I'm gonna mess up. <laughs> I think I'm gonna mess up on listing these. Because there's a lot of variants and stuff, so I'm gonna uh, I just got a funny feeling. And you know, imagine the gathering buyers and um uh, Pokemon buyers, golly, they're a ruthless. Like one time I mixed up uh, uh, one of the variants because I can I can tell the dang difference. There was nothing I could tell. I could tell no difference, and they're like, "Oh, you're stupid. You, you messed up. That's uh, this variant, not that variant." And I'm like, "I don't I, I don't I don't know. They look the same. They look the same, guys." Uh, so hopefully this doesn't <laughs> destroy me too badly. Um, but again, I'm gonna list everything I got, and that's the reason. Um, when you do stuff like this, you do want to list everything you got because. Uh, the 10 cents stuff will add up. The 5 cents stuff will actually, I won't go anything below that. Archangel, nice. Uh, ooh, nice little gin. When you uh, do the 5 cent cards and all that stuff, they all will add up. Oh, Monastery Mentor. Um, so you just got to keep in mind everything adds up. You always want to, uh, it's just you just always want to list everything you got. But the problem is, uh, even for me, I'm going to list it one time, right? Uh, and that's it. And that's why we're only going to do one massive break like we're doing today. Uh, and that's it. We're done. We're not going to do any more after that unless there's just something like a very big sale or uh, if I have more product or just something happens where I can't move the product. Uh, that's what I did with Scarlet and Violet. We did one massive, massive, massive opening um, just because we had too much Scarlet and Violet and that was just because it's not really selling too well uh, and I wanted to recoup some cash flow because it just wasn't selling too well you gotta, re you gotta re uh, get the cash flow back some way shape or form nice little mythic there okay so this box 3 is turning out really look at that that's looking out really good 367 so this is looking really really good again we're gonna have multitudes of uh, magic openings because we're just gonna rip and rip. We're just gonna rip. There's nothing else. Uh, I think magic in general is a strong ripping uh, candidate. Ooh, nice. Look at that one. Compared to like uh, Pokemon, which is a nice sealed one, the sealed goes up. Magic for some reason it doesn't go up at start, but it's okay. I don't. I don't really mind that. I don't mind. None of that. I do have the older Magic the Gathering sets that I'm just not opening. What I do think, though, um, as these sets get older, they appreciate they appreciate slower than Pokemon does. Pokemon appreciates pretty darn fast because a lot of the collector base runs through Pokemon really damn fast. It's like, dude, that's a quick thing. Um, but the QC on their cards are pretty bad. I'll just say I'll just be real on that. Um, getting into Magic the Gathering, uh, and just like Yu-Gi-Oh, like Yu-Gi-Oh is difficult. I, well, we got three of those things. All right, so this is looking good. Um, the thing is that when you look at Yu-Gi-Oh, 
Yu-Gi-Oh is tough because it's actually in-store per, uh, it, it's your purchasing in-store, right? That's your big number, right? In-store purchases and single cards. It's not the sealed. The sealed play does not work uh, when it comes down to it. So I'm thinking it's the same thing with uh, Magic the Gathering in-store and sealed is only sometimes when an actual product runs out and then you move it for decent money. But other than that, it may not be as good as you would think. So right now, we're going to test that fact for the singles. I know the singles sell very, very well. And Yu-Gi-Oh! Uh, also, their singles sold very, very well. Um, ooh, nice little Mythic again. Oh, this box is cracked out. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, uncommon, rare, Mythic. Dude, this one is a monster. This is a monster one. Last pack. Let's go. Let's go. This is a monster Mythic one. All right. I'm happy. All right. Might be able to break even, and the whole goal is to actually uh, break even. That's plain and simple. We want to break even as fast as we can, so we'll be all right. Rare, rare, there, and common. We got a total. Of, God, this is a big mythic count. All right. I'll tell you guys, we got a total of. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve mythics. That is a beautiful twelve mythic uh, box. Uh, love it. Now let's go to box number two. Okay, here we go. Let's go. Let's go. Token. Uh, but yeah, if you guys like Magic the Gathering, trying to get approval for Magic the Gathering is some shenanigans. I swear. Took me forever to get it, and I finally got it. I finally got it. So, we're going to take advantage of it. Uh, Lord of the Rings is just super hype. So, I'm hoping that the Rip and Ship community likes Lord of the Rings. So, we're going to go into Lord of the Rings like it's nothing. If it does sell out, then at least hopefully I get a decent uh, amount of it. Or an okay amount of it. That's all I really want. Okay amount is okay with me. Um, but, again, we're going to be running... Uh, singles for every new magic set uh, for the foreseeable future I think we're gonna just do a simple two cases of collectors uh, maybe a st uh, we're gonna try the set today I I'm not too sure because the set is definitely cheaper uh, to do it's just it's just a lot cheaper right uh, set compared to a collector you're paying about double the amount for a collector booster but you know you can see as what you're getting right so i may just end up just doing the collectors um from now on but you know hopefully we pull something great um <laughs> we got a nice mythic there rare double uncommon all right here we go boom 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 uh uncommon but you know when it comes down to all of this uh we're just looking for lorcana lorcana is your big big bread and butter um, but once i get more into the magic realm i think i'll i'll know more about how this works so you guys will see it i'll tell you guys if it's worth it it may be worth it at the beginning like right when the a, a set launches and then you're like all right cool cool boom 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 just start annihilating the the single market Nice mythic there, rare mythic, nice. Um, because, yeah, I, like I said, I'm coming in a little bit later, so I'm hoping to just break even, nothing else. Nothing more than break even is the goal of these types of video. Um, because, you know, it's already out, we gotta wait the, for the next set, which is the, um, what is the next set? Next set is the Lord of the Rings one. Ooh. Ren, the Realm Breaker. Nice, 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 nice. Uh, it's Lord of the Ring one, and that's where you're going to just be like, okay. Oh, nice little Return of the King. And, you know, that's going to be the big number. So, I think we're going, I'm not, you know, I'm not too big on it. So, I'm thinking I might go with like 10 grand on it or so. And, but that, you know, that's pennies compared to a lot of people, right? I, I can't afford that much Magic the Gathering because I got everything else to buy. Um. I'm just hoping that this venture is good enough 
two, maybe make one or two hundred dollars, right? That's it. One or two hundred dollars. Keep me busy. One or two hundred dollars and we'll be happy. One or two hundred. Dun, 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 dun. All right, last two packs before we get to the next one. But if you guys like magic, you know, and you guys want instant gratification, we will be a ripping ship shop on Twitch. It'll be the secret shop. Gold Star Secret Shop will be coming soon, here shortly. Uh, we will be doing a lot of Star Wars. Everything I can't sell on the site is going to be on that little secret shop that I'm going to put. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Because I'm going to be cheaper than... I'll, I'll guarantee you, I'll be cheaper than everyone else. I will 100% be real on that. Because I've always uh, looked at the ripping shippers. They're very expensive. They're very expensive. I won't be ripping shipping uh, white Schwartz because I don't really uh, like to be associated with the... Uh, was it dead product? So, and yeah, the ripping shippers do mess around with the dead product. I'll just tell you that right now. There's, re there's a way they unload everything, so just... Be very wary of how they unload. All right, this is not bad. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Let's go, token. We got one, two, three, four, five. Okay, uncommon land. Rare, rare, rare. I guess we can get no serial numbers. Okay, so this one's not that bad. We got a total of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven mythics. All right, last box here before we jump off and then uh yeah i'll probably end up doing the other collectors another three figure that out uncommon land rare rare mythic nice little mythic right there but this is coming becoming a lot already i'm already looking at them like Duh, this is a uh, huh maybe i don't want to do the set one yet maybe not the set so I'm not too sure. I might, I might nix the set boosters. I got, cause I got the set. No, I don't know. This is a, this is looking like it's a lot right now. So I might cancel the set booster openings. Um, yeah, I'm just looking at it. this is gonna be a lot. Uh, we'll find out after the next one. Um, like I said, I got the set. Set boosters. People do like it. Draft boosters. Uh, everybody says get set over draft, but collectors are the main one but afterwards uh, they say set boosters will sell better so i'm not too sure chandra nice i'm not too sure exactly how that works again we're just jumping in there i do like magic but i'm not like a point of sword of magic uh, gathering all i know is number wise this is the biggest uh the biggest uh tcg in the united states Hmm, Chandra, nothing too great here, nothing too great. All right, I think I did pull one of the good ones, but we'll know, we'll know in a bit here. Common, common, common. Uh, ba, ba, ba. Rare, rare, rare. Yeah, I do want to rip and ship some collectors. Just imagine pulling a serial number. <laughs> That's going to be some stuff. That will be some stuff. I'm hoping that the Lord of the Rings does have some strong cards in it, so... So I do like I I do want to keep a couple boxes sealed on that one. That one looks fun. Uncommon. Nice little mythic there. Alright, last side. Left side of the box. Yeah, I swear. This uh This uh these wrapping, this kinda of hurts a little bit. This definitely does hurt a little bit. Okay, land. Mythic, nice, nice, nice. Uh, what do you guys think? How do you guys think I did for the first case? This is the last one of the case. Did I do well? Did I not do well? Did I get wrecked? Uh, let me know. Let me know. Because uh, I do want to know. <laughs> I'll know after I put this all this uh, all this stuff into the uh, TCG play. I'll know if I got wrecked or not. Uh, you know. Let's see. Yeah, I think I'm, yeah, yeah, I think I'm gonna pass on the uh, coal, uh, the, the set boosters here. Okay, we got the land, uncommon land, rares. Oh, nice little mythic. Okay, uncommons. Like, dude, this is gonna. You gotta go foil, foil, non hollow foil, non showcase. Right, this is gonna be some fun stuff here. 
I'm just hoping that I know what the heck I do. I don't like, because customers are going to get mad if I send the wrong product. So just, just be wary about that. I might send a lot of the wrong product out. Ooh, nice mythic. Uncommon, uncommon. Ooh, nice mythic. Sword of one cent future. Nice. Rare token. Uh, all right, we got like six mythics. Not that bad. Not that bad. Six mythics. Okay, all right. Nothing with serial numbers. Two. Two. Land. Oh, land over here. Rare, rare. Uncommon double rare token. You. There we go. Boom. Oh, that's nice. Not bad. Not bad. All right. Last pack mojo here. Ah, boom. Common, common, common. Nice little land cycle. Common. Uncommon, uncommon, regular land. Ooh, a nice mythics. I don't know how to say that name. Uh, double rare. Double uncommon. Oh, look at that. Ragavan. Ragavan. Mythic there. Nice little token. We ended up this particular case. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine, seven. We got a lot of mythics. All right. Let me grab all the mythics here. So in this particular case all right let's go this way all right we got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen uh, nineteen twenty twenty one twenty two twenty three twenty four twenty five twenty six twenty seven twenty eight twenty nine mythics here this one we ended up with one two three four 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. 21. So total of 50 mythics. All right. 50 mythics. It's a case like this, if you just round it all the way up, is a $1,200 case. Did we make $1,200? Probably not. Um, so hit that like button, subscribe, make a comment. Let me know how I did. Uh, and I'll figure it out. We got case number two next.